In this lesson, we're gonna look at composite functions. So that's something like if your teacher says like H with a little circle and then G, and it's really weird. Students find it quite confusing on how to do it, but in this lesson, I'm gonna try my best to make it super easy for you to realize exactly how it works. So here's our first example. Now the most important part is this here. Some students think that that means multiply, but multiply they usually do like a solid little dot like that, whereas this is an open circle and it's quite a big circle. So what it means is the following, okay? It means that you must take H, so you take the first one, which is A plus five, so let's go write that out. Whoopsie. Well, let me actually just write A plus five. Okay, now I want you to highlight the A, okay? Now you're gonna go to G, whatever G is, there it is, and you're just gonna put that inside that one. So you're gonna have a squared plus two. See what we've just done there? We've just replaced, and then we're gonna have plus five. So we've replaced this a with g, okay? I know it might be a bit weird right now, but we're gonna practice quite a lot of these in this lesson. So that's gonna give you a squared plus two plus five, which is a squared plus seven. And that's your final answer. So you can then just say a dot g with an a, is equal to that. Let's try another one. So here in this example, the first letter is a G. So I want you to go write G as G's equation down. Highlight the letter, which is this one, then replace that letter with all of this. Okay, so that's gonna be two X cubed, take away five X and then take away three. You can put it in a bracket if you want, but in this case, it's not really gonna make a difference and then you're just gonna simplify. But in this case, there's not much we can do, and so that is the answer. And you can just say equals. Here's our next example. So you always start with the first letter, which is G. Go write its equation down, highlight the letter, and then just replace that with this. So that's gonna be two, then in brackets, you're gonna say N squared plus three, and then minus five. And so you end up with two N squared plus six, take away five, put these together, so it becomes two n squared plus one, and so let's just write that down, like that. 